got a lot of requests that Dolot you should build project using Binance chain because it's quite popular and most of the project are also going to the Binance chain so make a tutorial where we can learn about the deployment process building an application on the Binance chain so soon I'm going to start a project using the Binance chains when we start working on the flash loan because we'll use the API for determining the price of the token and we're going to do the flash loan and trade and arbitrage but in this video I'll show you that how you can connect the Binance chains with MetaMask because some of you are having some issue due to that you're not able to deploy your contract so one of you have requested me to make a video on this so that's why i'm making that so here you can see here i'm on the binance chain so i want to connect this binance chain the main network to my metamask and that's very simple so if you want to connect with any network all you have to do is to come back come back to their block explorer and here i am in the binance explorer and here you will find all the transaction is taking place on the binance chains but we are interested in connecting binance chain in our metamask so simple thing you have to do is simply scroll all the way down and here you will have a button in every single block explorer whether you talk about ethereum polygon solana you will have this option so click on this at bsc network and it's going to open up your metamask so just wait it's going to open up your metamask click on that and it will add all of this information in your network so it will say allow this site to add a network and that's what we have to do simply approve this one so it's going to put all the data and it's going to switch so right now we are connected with mumbai so it's going to switch to the binance chain so click on switch network and we are connected so if i come back in the metamask and here you will find that we are using binance chain so binance smart contract smart chain mainnet so we have this binance chain so if i come back here if i go back to the account one still i have nothing in this particular phone so this is how you can add any network if you want to add polygon mumbai or testnet you can do that simply come here and all you have to do is to find a button so here you will find a button called add mumbai network and it will add that in your metamask which i already have it and i want to add the testnet as well so come back in the new tab and search for binance testnet this is what you have to search binance smart chain test explorer click on that if i scroll all the way down you can see one thing that we don't have any button so how you can connect this binance test to your metamask that's very simple all you have to do is come here and click on that and here you will have this two option called bs testnet and open bnb testnet so these are the two options we'll have Let's click on this next one and it will take you right up here and if you scroll down if you scroll down here you will have the button called open bnb testnet and click on this add to it's going to open up the browser and it's going to click on this approve and it's going to add the network to your test network so simply click on that now if you come back and open up your metamask you can able to find the details that we are connected with this particular one op bnb test network so that's how you can add test network as well in your metamask so this is the simple process you have to do don't need to be confused any blockchain you want to deploy your contract or connect or test simple thing you have to do is come back to the block explorer of that particular blockchain and simply scroll all the way down and you will find a button which allow us to add the network to the metamask that's pretty simple because a lot of you guys have confusion that how we can add how what are the configuration we have to do for a specific blockchains <laughs> because a lot of you guys have done with the manual process and you guys have encountered a lot of errors like you have click on the network click and the add network then you have come here in the network tabs and here you are configuring it manually but you don't need to do that all you have to do is to simply go to the block explorer and simply add that one so we got this particular chain so that's the only thing i want to talk about hope you guys have got an idea that how you can add that if you still have any confusion do let me know in the comment section and do let me know that how you can get the faucet just share the link of the website from where you will get the faucet so other can have the benefit and i want to leave on you guys so with that i'm ending this video hope you guys have enjoyed that if you still have any confusion do let me know i will try to help you in that have a wonderful day bye, -bye.